decent. Fluctuating. Anxious. Stable. Managing the last couple years with COVID, um, the concerns with students and their mental health. Seeing what other people are doing and comparing myself. So whether it's like social media or just from talking to people or whatever, I think I'm always like, oh, I should be doing more. And I think that comparison is the biggest struggle for me. Um, I feel like right now it's just like college applications and just getting through it. It's such a like a big decision, uh, a big part of your life. College applications trying to come back to normal life, quote unquote normal life, after the pandemic. I think just working out consistently. I think going outside and like getting up. So I think a big thing is whether it's just like going on a 10 minute walk or like having a friend meet you for coffee or something like that. I think pushing yourself even when you feel like you really don't want to, to like get up and do something and leave your house and that kind of thing. I love to read and to be with friends and family. Exercise, meditating. administration is, uh, especially having lots of wellness days. I feel like, like the school is, but the individual teachers sometimes know. I think the school is trying to. I think the school wants to do its best in terms of helping both students and staff deal with mental health. I just don't, I think it's hard. I think people haven't really figured out what we should be doing to help people with mental health. More like for teachers, maybe a couple more personal days. Just setting up, um, I guess, like dedicated time, like uh, similar to Wildcat Wednesday, just for them, for themselves, uh, completing work, uh, stuff like that. Um, I think coworkers just being there for each other and covering classes when needed is also helpful. Helping my students scale back a little bit and see that they don't have to take five APs and all honors classes, that they can actually kind of explore. 